Well, pretty much. <laughs> when, your, when your guy puts his foot down, it means it's game on, man. Game on. Someone's seen a leopard, and now we're on our way. We are now on our way to Cinnamon Wild Yala. It's not a, uh, it's not a budget hotel either. We, we kind of, this is, this is Fanat's birthday, uh, the whole safari trip. So we're going to Cinnamon Wild Yala and we're gonna do a couple of safari trips there, try and, try and find some leopards uh, and whatever else is there. Um, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Wipe my face. Obviously look dirty. This smells like What's that smell like? Some sort of herb. Well, we've arrived at Cinnamon Wild Yala. It's very nice here. First impressions are pretty good. They've got a nice shaded pool area for us burn victims. Oh, thank you. Thank you. And we made it. Probably the nicest place we've stayed at yet. Um, as I say, this is not a, really a budget hotel. We kind of splashed out on this one a little bit. I mean, in the grand scheme of things, you could probably get a Premier Inn in the UK for the same price as what we paid for this, but it feels pretty expensive compared with, you know, the seven or eight pound a night jobbies we've been staying in. Yeah, we've, it, it's a really nice place here. You've got the lake. I don't know if you can see that from there literally full of crocodiles and water buffalo and there's loads of birds here and all sorts of stuff so we're gonna have a little walk around don't get too close to the water though that's what they said and we just saw a little video played on the uh on the screen in there of an elephant walking through here definitely wild it smells very nice in here as well it smells like nat thinks it smells like cinnamon yeah. i don't know i don't think it smells like cinnamon really it smells the same as what the towels we just had. The place is called Cinnamon Wild Yala, so... It's cinnamon. So you would, you would expect... It's cinnamon, guys. Thank you would, to you would expect it to be uh, cinnamon. I have to taste it. I've kind of fucked up as well. Look. That is dirty washing. And that is clean washing. I've been neglecting it. Now... Do they offer a laundry service here? Uh, they do, but it's expensive. How much is expensive? For underwear, if you wanted to clean seven pairs of boxes, that would cost 700 rupees. Seven, 700 100 rupees? 700 rupees per item of clothing. Like right, that. no, we're not doing that. I'm going to be wearing them inside out. Right, we have decided to go for a walk. There's no other tourists doing this. Uh, it does feel a little bit silly. Because there, there was a leopard spotted here two days ago. There's elephant dung everywhere. There is, yeah, there's water buffaloes and crocodiles in the lake literally just behind me. So it, well, it, it feels a little bit dumb, but at the same time, it's quite, it's quite fun for the adventure, you know? So here we go.
we're just stopping for a bit of lunch now uh, in the uh, bar area. Obviously the prices are a little bit more expensive here. It's so funny whenever you come to somewhere like this and they, uh, they ask if you want a drink, you say no, and they look at you in complete disgust. I don't need a drink, bro. I got this. I got my fucking life straw. In all seriousness though, these things are actually pretty cool. Life straw. You can drink tap water or anything out of them really. Save you a bit of money. You haven't got, haven't got to keep using uh, plastic bottles either. Now, everyone who knows me knows I don't drink this shit usually. But it was in the mini bar. It's 30 degrees outside. It's cold and it's in a glass bowl. How can I not? <sighs> Perfect. Right, Matt's just come running to the room to let me know there's a massive crocodile. Right here, outside the room, if you want to have a little look at this. Safari, safari. Good morning. We're off to a safari, first one of the day. Because we've seen some leopards. All right, whole topic up was 5 a.m. We've now got to wait until half five, 5.30 a.m. for them to open up the um, office to let us in. Um, and entrance to the park is on top of pretty much all the safaris I saw and uh, entrance to the park is 13,000 rupees per person. So just bear, bear in mind that you've got to pay that as well. And we are doing two safaris today and we have got to pay that twice. That's not a day pass. So um, it, it does work out quite expensive doing this, uh, but it's worth it, hopefully. Hopefully we get to see some animals. Otherwise we're just paying a load of money to cruise around in this all day. <laughs> Picture of it, Natalia. It's fuzzy. It's fuzzy. Yeah. The whole thing. Oh, uh, the picture. How? Because it's still low light. Isn't Bullshit! It? It's fucking bright. I can see you <laughs> on this thing. Remember, we've got low battery. <sighs> Nat wanted a job for this, so I made a wildlife photographer. What have you got here, then? They're not fuzzy. Yeah, they're when good. You zoom, when you zoom in, they're fuzzy. Well, they look good. <laughs> they look good not zoomed in. So just don't zoom. <laughs> right, we've been in here for five minutes and seen a leopard already. So, um, fucking buzzing. What is it? Oh yeah. The chicken. Oh yeah. Jungle fowl, um, local Sri Lankan chicken. Bit of a bit anti climactic after the leopard, to be honest. Wildlife photographer is gonna cry. <laughs> there might be another leopard over here, so I hope there is. 
as soon as there's a leopard, they will call their mates and they help each other out, which is good for them, you know. The more people that get footage, have a good experience and tell all their friends about this place, you know, the more money they're going to make and the more, more eyes they're going to bring onto their, their national park here. It just means uh, we've now got away in this. This uh, restaurant, they do a buffet dinner, which is 5,000 rupees per person. Don't know about you guys, but whenever I go to a buffet, I'm looking for the best value food, and that is meat. Especially as I hardly have had any meat since I've been out here, so let's do it. This tastes just like cinnamon. Natalia was correct. The room did in fact smell like cinnamon earlier and that towel also smelled like cinnamon. You heard it here first, guys. There we go. We've had a bit of a result here. For some reason, they've given us a 20% discount. Not really sure why, but I'm not gonna argue that. I had loads of meat tonight. I had cheese and bread. I had cheese and bread. You go to an all-you-can-eat buffet and have bread. <laughs> Such a waste. Lucky we got the discount. Makes it all worth it still. Just starting our second safari of the day. Quite excited for this. Uh, well, the one earlier was fucking great. We just got to pay another 13,000 per person now. It sounds like a lot, but I think it, as long as it goes towards, you know, the conservation of the site and helps to protect the animals in here, then goes to a good cause. And we had a great time this morning. Really looking forward to this. It's going to be good. Pretty much, when, when, your, when your guy puts his foot down, it means it's game on, man. Game on. Someone see the leopard. Thanks, mate. Holiday. Amazing. Oh, I can't recommend to come here enough. Seriously. The Isla National Park. Gosh. Well, we're back at the hotel. I am a knackered. I'm covered in dust. It's been such a good day. Now it's uh, definitely time for some rest and dinner. We are stranded at Cinnamon Wild Yala. I'm thinking we just walk out to the road. The walk is three and a half hours. 